Okay, so we're going to act as though we just got a new Vumber lead. So we will be alerted to that as soon as it comes through. It'll come through on Podio. You'll get an email and probably a notification as well. So I'm going to go ahead and um, click on that lead. And then the new lead is generated as soon as um, Vumber registers it. So this is all done by Vumber. If we scroll down, oops, if we scroll down to the bottom, okay, we will. Um, you can select that it was a Vumber number, and this file here is the audio from the voicemail that was left. So go ahead and click on that. Mine's going to open in iTunes. This is a test email, practicing showing how we can uh, use Podio and Bumper to work on our leads. The sample address we're going to use is 2069 Druid Park Drive, a three-bed, three-bath home. Okay, so once we've listened to that information, um, this caller did not leave her phone number, but that's okay. But the, did leave an address. So we'll go ahead and type in 2069 Druid Park Drive. And as you're typing, you can see um, that the map is going to pop up. So since we have the address, before we call this person back, she did say that it was a three bed, three bath. So we can go ahead and put that in. We don't know if it's occupied. We don't really know anything else about the property. Um, but we're going to come to the Maris now and we're going to get our comp link so what we'll do is once we're logged in we'll go to search residential general we're going to be looking for properties that have sold in the last 365 days um, we don't know much about this house at this point so we're just going to go ahead and go to map and then jump to address and we'll type in the address that was left on the voicemail okay we're gonna pull out a little bit we see there are some sales right in this neighborhood which is where we're going to be looking so I'm going to hit my radius here and a lot of times in Baltimore you know major roadways are going to separate the neighborhoods <clears throat> So these are going to be the ones that I'm going to concentrate on, especially not knowing, um, you know, too much about it. So I'm going to make sure that whole neighborhood gets put in there. Then we're going to go to results. So that picks up about 20 results, and it looks like there are sold properties sort of all over the place, um, which is fine. Our job our job is going to be to take a look and go through them so what you need to do now is go ahead and check all of them see that they're all checked so 20 of 20 are checked and we're going to email you're going to email it to yourself so in this case I'm going to say house comps we're just going to put an H there because if you don't fill it in then it won't let you send it I'm going to send. Then when I go back to my email, okay, the house comps have come through. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this. And then I'm going to paste it to the comps link here. So, oops. So that will save automatically. So when Terry or I go back in to, you know, check out the leads once you've talked to the person, we'll have the comps right here and can go from there. If it's not a clear cut property or a clear cut, I'm sorry, neighborhood, what you'll do is a radius and go out a half mile to be safe. Okay, when we do that with this property, you know, it picks up a few more houses for us, so a 30 instead of 20, um, which is fine. So once you have this information, um, you are better prepared to make the phone call. Um, 
And even though the caller did not leave her phone number, you can see right here, our Vumber number is the number that they called. That's the campaign number. And then this is the number that we'd be calling out to. So um, we can have that information there. So this is how you would go ahead and go from the Podio notification or the Vumber notification into Podio so you're set for a win when you give a call to the seller. Thanks so much. Let us know if you have any questions.